Hi guys, welcome back to Style Nova. Today I'm going to be reviewing uh, Tory Burch Penelope Pumps, Double T Sports Slides, Bombay Miller Slides, Eleanor Embellished Belt, 41mm Square Sunglasses, Banana Republic Mini Style Clutch, Think Royal and Tiny Dancer Crossbody Bag and Bar Shoulder Bag, Ricardo Beverly Hills Radio Drive Large Check-In, Stephanie Johnson Miami Piper Tote, Floral Street Fragrances Sunflower Pop, Joseph and Joseph Viva Large Cosmetic Organizer, and Banana Republic South India Ring. Please stay till the end of the video to see the full review and enjoy. The first item I have here is the Royal and Bark Lotus Shoulder Bag in color pearl blue. This bag is made from polyester, but the material is very high quality and it's the type that will be easy to clean. The stitches are straight. It has a magnetic flap, which is my favorite closure because it is fast to open and close. Uh, the interior is divided into two open compartments by the one in the middle that has a zipper and there is one more small compartment with a zipper. At the back it has exterior magnetic pocket as well. It comes with two straps, one is gunmetal chain and the other one is crossbody nylon strap. The top handle and the straps are all removable and you can mix and match them. This bag is medium sized, I was able to even fit a 500ml water bottle. Currently the best price is on Amazon, it sells for $128. So if you live somewhere where it's still cold and cloudy, you can pair it with white uh, bomber jacket for a pop of color. Uh, it also goes well with a different combination of blue colors. Another great color you can match it with is blue-gray or gunmetal and of course anything black. This one is Stink Royal and Tiny Dancer Quilted Cross Body Bag in Deep Cobalt, uh, one of my favorite colors. This bag is of the same quality as the first one. It has a zipper, uh, now it's kind of short, so it won't be easy to see inside. Uh, the bag is small, but the interior is large enough for the big phone, uh, small card wallet, keys, and a lipstick or mirror. Uh, it has three pockets on one side and one small zippered pocket on the other side. Um, it comes with the two removable straps as well, uh, like the first one. This specific color only sells on SaxFifthAvenue.com for $144. My favorite outfits are light blue jacket and white skirt and this combination of orange, white and brown colors definitely goes well with gunmetal gray color, orange coat and anything black. Tory Burch Penelope Pumps in Perfect Navy. Uh, if you like very feminine style, these ones are perfect. They are all over leather made in Italy. The main body is made out of suede and the dots are smooth white leather. The heel is medium and very comfortable. Since these pumps have narrow toe, I would recommend to get one size up. Unfortunately, I'm not able to find any store that sells them. I bought them recently on Tory Burch website at their secret sale, but I see some people sell them on Poshmark. Tory Burch 25mm Bomb Miller Slides in color vintage firm slash sea bubble. I was never interested in green shoes, but they caught my eye because of this cool color combination of dark green and Tiffany blue. They are made in Vietnam and true to size, very comfortable. The only store that sells them right now is Farfetch, and for some reason it says that they are made out of 100% rubber, which is incorrect. They are all over leather, and the only rubber part are those traction dots on the sole. Tory Burch Double T Patent Leather Sports Slides in Misty Aqua. I am in love with this color. 
I would call it Tiffany blue. They are made in Vietnam as well, true to size, very comfortable. The footbed is cushiony, leather upper and lining, rubber outsole. Guys, this color is so popular, Nordstrom is the only store that still has them and they only have few sizes left. Tory Burch 41mm square sunglasses. The reason they caught my eye is because they are one of my favorite colors, blue-gray. They come in a hard case, made in China, and fall under the type of filter 3N, which means protection against sun glare is high and the filter is normal. The only store you can buy them from is SaxFiftAvenue.com and they are on sale. Banana Republic Mini Stella Cloud Clutch. I've been eyeing it for such a long time and unfortunately Banana Republic doesn't like to give discount on leather, so I had to save money for some time to buy it. It's 100% leather with fabric interior and made in Italy. Very high quality smooth leather. Has a magnetic snap closure uh, with a very long skinny strap that you can hide inside of purse to wear like a clutch. You can also wear it across the shoulder or tie the strap to make it shorter and wear on the shoulder. Currently, you can only buy it at bananarepublic.com for $280. Another Tory Burch item is Eleanor Embellish Leather Belt made out of 100% leather, 1 inch in width. It has gold on buckle with stones that look like amber. I really like how skinny it is and I can wear it with jeans or around my waist. The only thing I don't like about it, it's hard to close because the holes are so tight, but I think in time they will stretch. The only store you can buy it uh, from is Neiman Marcus Online. Stephanie Johnson Miami Piper Tote in Cheetah Holograph. It is such a fun color. It, it is medium sized and somewhat transparent. Honestly, I don't know what is it made from. It looks like some kind of plastic. It has a nice addition inside a snap in pouch. It's not very well structured, so I wouldn't wear it on a daily basis, but it is stylish enough to take it to the beach. You can buy this online from ricardobeverlyhills.com. Ricardo Beverly Hills Rodeo Drive large check-in luggage in silver lilac. I've seen this company before in Costco, but Costco sells only black or gray colors. This is my second luggage in life, and I am in love with this color. The combination of lilac and silver is amazing. The handle is sturdy and luggage moves smoothly. It does expand, it has a lock and ID card holder. They also offer protection in case it is lost. The interior is lined with fun print. It has inside three bags for shoes. I can't wait to travel with it. You can buy this um, only from ricardobeverlyhills.com.
Floral Street Sunflower Pop Fragrance. I am very sensitive to smells and I usually reject 90% of fragrance, but this smells heavenly. This is a collaboration with uh, Van Gogh Museum, which is why you see a replica of Van Gogh sunflower painting on the bottle. It is a floral, strong scent, but it's unique and smells expensive. I see Anthropology Online has it on sale right now, but other stores like Sephora and Nordstrom also carry it. Make sure you smell it at the store and really like it before you buy it. So this beautiful ring I bought from Banana Republic. 99% of the time I wear silver because it matches my skin color the best and I've been also eyeing it for a long time. Finally, I bought it. They only uh, have two sizes there. Uh, it's handmade in India out of silver and has a big pink tourmaline stone at the center uh, as well as sapphires and dark diamonds. However, uh, the company that makes this jewelry is called Ethnopur. I checked out their website and they have a lot of beautiful pieces for silver lovers. The prices are in euros, but they do ship international. And it says on their website that the price of the shipping is built into the price of the jewelry. And the last one is Joseph & Joseph Viva Large Cosmetic Organizer. Love this organizer, it has a lot of compartments on top and a large compartment that you can slide open. Also, it has a double-sided mirror that you can clip on anywhere on the organizer. It holds a lot of makeup and the best part is you can move it everywhere. Uh, currently, you can buy it on Amazon um, with a bit of discount. I will be returning Tory Bird sunglasses only because they are a bit high and they don't suit my face frame. Sadly, Banana Republic purse is so small it doesn't fit my iPhone 13 Pro Max and this beautiful ring is just too bulky for my small hand. But I will be checking out other pieces by this company. Uh, as much as I love the color of Think Royal and Bag, I just don't like the shape of it. Uh, thank you to those who stayed with me until the end and subscribe for future videos. See you soon.